Hello everyone and thanks for joining us. We begin with an issue that local cities have been grappling with and that's whether to raise the minimum age to buy tobacco products to 21. Tuesday night, the city of Plymouth said yes. They voted to raise the age to buy tobacco starting next summer. But as Shannon Slatten reports, it was a close vote. I'm here today to help fight back against cancer in the tobacco industry, but I need your help. The Plymouth City Council heard an earful during Tuesday night's public hearing of an ordinance changing the minimum age to buy tobacco from 18 to 21. We cannot pass up the opportunity tonight to stand up to big tobacco. Any step to prevent young people from becoming addicted to tobacco products is a step in the right direction. We can set an example for communities across the state. There were fewer opposing voices, but they were strong ones. Businesses who rely on the sale of tobacco products said customers would just drive to neighboring cities to buy their tobacco. First of all, we're going to lose a lot of customer because we have a lot of customer. I've been there since they opened the store. We have a lot of customer between the age 18 and 21. We stand to lose a lot of inside sales, gas sales, ancillary sales, and I don't have the corporate backing that Holiday and Super America do. It's just me. City council members seem to agree that they hope the state legislature tackles this issue. A bill that would do this was introduced last May, but they did proceed to a vote, with three council members voting against the ordinance. The folks over in New Hope and Maple Grove and the other stores over there will grin a slight grin tonight. It's a noble goal. It puts out a statement but it really isn't going to achieve the objective of stopping 15, 16, 17-year-olds getting it from 18-year-olds because they can go to another city. The four council members voting for raising the minimum age said they were comfortable with Plymouth taking the lead in the Northwest Metro on what they call an issue of public health. Sometimes we just have to do the right thing. So I would rather be a leader on this issue than a follower. So I'm going to support it. In Plymouth, Shannon Slatten, CCX News. The council did push the start date to July 1st instead of January. Edina, St. Louis Park, and Bloomington have also voted to raise the minimum age to buy tobacco to 21.